Hello and welcome to R&DW Adventures. I'm Renee. And I'm Daryl. And today for junk fooding, we have corn nuts. We were shopping for stuff for the car and then we decided to make a junk food out of this because who knew there were so many flavors of corn nuts. So today we have ranch, chili picante, barbecue, barbecue. I can't see it. Original. Original. And then we have the one that you really wanted to try, which is Mex Mexican street corn. Yes, because yes. it's dead. Exactly. Okay, so where should we start? Well, I would say we start with the original. Okay. Okay, so it's original. It's original. Can we say anything else? It's original. Crunchy, <laughs> Crunchy corn nuts. And Do it does like have the nuts? little... Yeah, not so much actually. They go through phases. Yeah, they're they're little corn kernels. Yep, and they're crunchy. Are, like grilled. And dried? Not quite freeze dried, but Yeah, no, they're not grilled, are they? I don't know. How do you make corn nuts? If you know, let us know. Taste, hear, and enjoy. I have no idea. No. Yeah. But it's not like popcorn. The ingredients are corn, corn oil, and salt. It's original but, and yeah, very much what it is, but this is a good flavor. Yeah, they're good. And one of the things that you know you run into with some of the nuts is when they're overdone or not overdone. You know, right. they've gotten these down over the years and they're just good. So I'm giving them a four. Yeah, likewise. But now they're doing the flavors and they have for a while, but it's not new. I don't think I've tried the flavors. You have. I, I don't know that you've tried these flavors. But yep. I remember trying some flavors with you years ago. But we'll do, uh, move on to the barbecue flavor, which, frankly, I'm not sure that we're going to like. No. There we so, go. They've got the uh, little bit of the red tint to them. I mean, if you like barbecue flavor, like the chips and the smoky. Yeah, it is a smoky barbecue. I think you'd like them. They're not really for me, but I'm still going to give them a three because it's got a good flavor if you like that flavor. Yeah. Um, I'm only going to give it a two and a half, actually. Okay. I do not like this flavor, and it comes across in smoky. a way that I don't like on you don't, here. You don't like a lot of smoky flavored mm -hmm. things, though. But even beyond the smoky, it has like a kind of weird taste to it that I don't like. <clears throat> That's what I find in most barbecue flavors that I don't like. It's this, it's this, um, I can't but it, quite I would my... call it like, uh, pork fat almost. <laughs> so as she makes a mess, we'll move on to the ranch, which again, I don't expect to like this one. I, I do like ranch dressing. I do. As like a dip. Right. Or on the right type of salad. Not sure if I like it anymore. Not so much on my chips. However, I'm assuming these might make good croutons in salad. That could be. So okay. this They're does kind have. Of green. Yeah, I was gonna say a kind of a green, bluish. It smells texture, like. Texture or color. Actually, I like it better than I thought it would. Yeah, it's actually pretty good. Um, I do think it would be good in salad though. I'm going to give that a three. I'm going to give it a three and a half. I would not get it over the uh, original. Mm -mm, but I will give it a three and a half. And now chili picante. Okay. This is one of the two that you really wanted to try. Mm -hmm. Well, it's not that I don't like spicy. Yeah. It's that I don't like the barbecue sauce so much. Not my thing. That has a weird kind of color to it. It's a weird kind of smell to it. It's not like the red, but it's more better like orange. Better than the barbecue for sure. Paprika. Mm. It has very much a lime flavor that I'm enjoying. Mm-hmm. Like the chili limon flavored mm -hmm. I do like this. I don't know what I want to get. I'm going to call this a four. I think it is as good as the other one. There's a bit of I, that said, I think I could eat many more of the original corn nuts than this. Well, maybe we should that's mix them together. That's going to get overwhelming. Like mix them together and wouldn't get it as overwhelming. I'm not sure that that's a good flavor either. Okay. We might have to try that. 
All right, and moving on to the Mexican street corn. I <laughs> don't know what you're doing, but it's you're one of it. one of each. You can try it later. Oh. It does not want. It you does to not eat. want me to open it. It got to a certain like, point, nope. and it stopped. Like rip stop. All right. Apologies for the delay, but we now have street corn. A little bit, not much. All right, there you go. So again, more of an orange uh, color. I don't like it. I don't hate it. That is a weird flavor. I can't figure out what it's kind of like chili picante with butter. Chili powder, lime juice, paprika, garlic. Yeah, I don't hate this one. I don't hate it, but I don't I'm going to give it a three and a half, I think. I'll give it a three and a half. I wanted it to be so much better. Yeah. So these are our favorite. Yep. The original and the uh, chili picante. Taste what they taste like together. I don't know. I don't know that I like them together. Actually, I think I had two originals just now. Yeah, I had. I definitely had the chili picante. No, I think you and, had both the both. No, I had. I had definitely oh. one of each. All right. And the problem is that the original overpowered the chili picante, and I couldn't even taste the chili picante. Oh, well, that's weird. Well, already then, keep them separate. But those are our favorites. <laughs> so that's going to wrap up this one, though. Make sure to check out our other videos over here. We've got a lot of other stuff aside from the junk fooding. We've got a bunch on uh, travel if you like doing that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. Hit the subscribe and bell icon as well though. On this side, we're going to have that junk fooding playlist. So we've got hundreds more of these kind of videos. Oh boy. Get rid of, I, get I like, rid of, get rid of. Yeah.